In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to unsend an email on Gmail after 30 seconds. We've all sent emails that we immediately wished we could take back. Maybe it was a mistakenly attached file, a spelling error, or even the wrong recipient. Fortunately, Gmail provides a handy feature that allows you to undo a sent email, giving you a little extra time to catch those mistakes before they become permanent. Let's walk through the process of configuring Gmail settings to maximize your undo send period to 30 seconds, so you have ample time to recall any email you might send in error. First, let's start by navigating to your Gmail inbox. Open your preferred web browser and type in mail.google.com. This will take you directly to the Gmail sign-in page if you're not already logged in. Enter your credentials and make sure you're viewing the inbox of the correct account. Once you're securely logged into your Gmail account, we'll proceed to adjust the settings required for this feature. Now, take a glance toward the top right corner of the Gmail interface. You'll notice an icon resembling a gear, which represents the settings menu. Go ahead and click on this gear icon to open a drop down menu. Here, you'll see a quick view of some basic settings, but don't fret, we're looking for something a bit more specific. So instead of selecting options from this drop down, look for the see all settings button and click on that to dive deeper into Gmail's configuration options. Once you've clicked see all settings, you'll be directed to the settings page with multiple tabs. The default tab is usually general, which is precisely where we need to be. Scroll down through the list of options on this general tab until you find the undo send settings. This feature helps you configure the cancellation period for your sent emails. By default, Gmail may be set to a brief time frame, but we want to expand this window. So locate the drop down menu next to the undo send option. Upon clicking this drop down, you'll be given several time intervals to choose from, 5, 10, 20, and 30 seconds. To afford yourself the greatest chance of retracting a hastily sent email, let's select 30 seconds from this menu. This ensures that you have half a minute to reconsider and unsend the email before it's permanently delivered into your recipient's inbox. After you've selected the 30 second option, we're onto a crucial step. It's easy to overlook, but very important. Make sure to scroll down to the bottom of the settings page and click save changes. Without doing this, your new settings won't be applied and you may inadvertently send an email without having the 30 second recall feature enabled. With these changes saved, you've now successfully configured your Gmail to allow you up to 30 seconds to undo a sent email. Anytime you send a message, you'll notice an option that appears briefly at the bottom of your screen saying undo or view message. Clicking undo within this time frame will retract your email, moving it back to your drafts folder or allowing you to edit and resend if necessary. Having this extension in the time period for unsending emails can be a real lifesaver. Take a few moments to send a test email to yourself and practice using the undo feature. This will not only give you peace of mind that everything is set up correctly, but also familiarize you with how quickly you should act should you need to retract an email in the future. Remember that this feature won't stop the email from reaching its recipient after that 30 second window. So if you often find yourself reconsidering emails even after sending them, it's a good habit to double check recipients, attachments, and any other details before hitting send. This way the 30 second safety net is just an added layer of protection rather than something you regularly rely upon. In conclusion, by configuring this handy feature in your Gmail settings, you've efficiently safeguarded yourself against those little email mishaps that can happen to anyone. It only takes a few moments to adjust these settings, but it can potentially save you from a lot of awkward follow-up emails or explanations. Thanks for following along today, and I hope you feel more confident in managing your Gmail communications. If you found this tutorial helpful, feel free to check out more of our guides for additional tips and tricks to make the most out of your Gmail experience.